Hi, Looney here. Building stuff is my personal meditation. I can focus all my thoughts on one thing. This releases all the stress and bans all other thoughts. For my soldering, I am using this solder fat. This ensures a good heat transportation and isn't conductive. To protect the copper from oxidation, I pre-tin the whole board by taking a bit solder on the tip and dragging it along the traces. If you have too much solder and the hole is closed by a solder, you can drag it away from the hole and it will open. I clean the board from the remaining fat by using some alcohol. I always have some long pin headers since they are best value for money. I can break them to the right length. If they break at the wrong pin, you might be lucky like me in this case and the opposite side has the correct pin count. This is fitting snugly. To solder the header pins, I put the iron on the one side of the pin to heat it up and add the solder on the other side until it reflows. This ensures enough heat and avoids cold solder joints.
soldering surface mount devices is a bit more complicated. You can fix the device by soldering two pins of opposite corners. This will avoid that it moves around and you can concentrate on soldering each pin. I take a bit solder on the tip and put it against the pin I want to solder. This will transport the heat to the pad and the pin. Just by trying you will get a feeling for this. Okay, this is good. Next pin, please. Ah, much better. Now clean it again from the remaining solder fat. To get to all the corners I use this toothbrush with some alcohol. This looks nice, really satisfying.